Hello everybody, Piperboy Let's Play here, bringing you another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. Now, as you can see, I've added a couple things to our to-do list. We have our regular Make a Tree Farm vid uh, video, which will be coming up soon. Um, but I've added a couple other things that, obviously, well, they're pretty obvious. One, I want to find a village. That will be very helpful. Doesn't matter where I find it, just that I find it. Find a dungeon and find a temple. Those three things might be accomplished today. Because guess what we're going to do? We're going exploring. And guess where we're going? In the desert. Actually, um, do I have any redstone? Don't think I have any redstone yet, because I want to be able to make a compass, actually. Darn. Alright, what I think I'll do is these are my coordinates. Boom, 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 boom. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go off. And then I will, if I find anything interesting, I will cut to it. And I will also uh, show the coordinates where it is. That way I know where to find it again. That way I will always have, uh, some, that way I will always have the area where to go. Um, okay, so when I find something interesting, or if I find something interesting, I will cut to it. See you in a minute. I'm back with a couple of biomes. Uh, our desert is right over there. Our house is somewhere in that direction. We have an extreme hills biome. Oh joy. We have a swamp biome, which it's okay. Don't dislike it quite as much as the extreme hills or anything, but it's still not all that awesome. But more importantly, we have a forest biome, which I'm looking forward to. Especially because now we can get our uh, the last kind of tree that we're missing. Also, there's a wolf. Oh, there's a wolf pack. I ain't touching these guys. Um, nothing too interesting around. Alright, so I'll drop down a birch tree, get a couple saplings from it, and then I'll meet you guys wherever I next end up. Oh, also... Coordinates. Alright, I didn't really find anything interesting aside from that. Um, so, the only... I didn't, actually, I didn't find anything interesting aside from that. There is nothing to be seen. Absolutely nothing. Because I, I can't... Just say so you no, know, I came back in the, near the middle of the night. Um, nope. Well, I actually, no, that was that's good that there was not a there because I was hoping that there. I, I was just making sure that there weren't any creepers hanging around. But I managed to get a couple bones, which will help us grow our melons. And I managed to get a couple saplings to grow our trees. Darn. Making sure, because whenever I get out of my house after night, I will always sprint. Just in case there's anything around that I didn't see before. I saw a spider somewhere around here. Oh, yeah, more bone. I saw a spider hanging around. I want to kill him. Because I only managed to get a little bit of stuff. Oh, well. Anyway, so... Um, I think... To finish off this episode, we're going to build the tree farm. I'll just grab this and do what I wanted to do with these in the first place. That. I don't have one stone, bit of stone brick left. There we go. That should... Let's see, let me get some uh, dirt as well. Let me also grab myself a shovel. There we go. In fact, <laughs> keep adding things on. I'll just put away all the stuff that I don't really need. Alright, that should be good. Now then. That's moving around. That's gonna freak me out. Alright. The moment this is how big I'll make mine. 
and then I'll expand it as I need to. I'm just gonna have one of every tree growing for now. Except for the jungle tree, until I get a lot more of the jungle cleared out. But I should probably also go grab the pickaxe. So we didn't get anything I really wanted to do. Well, I was hoping that my jungle would be, well, my desert would be nice, awesome desert, but absolutely nothing in this entire desert. Actually, that's not nearly big enough. What am I thinking? This should be more like it. I'm locks. Yeah, nine by nine. That's a little bit more like it. Alright. Um, so I'll do this, and then when they meet up, I will put one in there. I have one for one of every tree, and then some. Alright. There we go. That should be enough for each of them. No. Alright. Alright, this makes it a lot better, because I know where my trees are going to be growing now. This should be big enough. I mean, don't need that much room. Oh, excellent. Perfect timing tree. Um, let me grab saplings and where's my axe? Don't appear to have an axe. Oh, well, that's what I'm gonna go ahead and do. I'm gonna go ahead and make an axe. Not sign. So I'll just go ahead and do this. And hopefully, I'll be able to get more saplings from you. Haha! -ha! Alright, so I'll grow. I should be able to grow three of each. Keep the tall ones away from each other. Ah, uh, give me a sapling. Nothing? Are you kidding me? <sighs> Guess where I'm going. Going back over to get a little bit more. I don't like these trees. <laughs> they don't give me very many saplings. It's more efficient just to go over here and chop them down manually and <sighs> darn. The other reason, probably said this before, but the only reason I'm not actually getting jungle trees as well to grow is because, well, they're right over here. I mean I'm right literally next to a jungle. Thank you, but I want three. Thank you very much. When I see three of these in my inventory, I'll be glad to leave. Stop topping you and your brethren down. <sighs> when I get all these growing, then I'll actually I'll cut back once I've gotten one of every sap uh, two more of these saplings. Okay, there we go. That's three saplings. Yes, I know there's a zombie somewhere around there. But I don't really care. Alright. Um. Oh, looks like one of the trees already... Oh, no, wrong tree. <laughs> but I guess we can chop him down and not really care about planting him back. There we 
There we go. Now I've got a real tree farm going on. When I was playing Xbox with my dad, he, uh, we, we chopped down so many of these trees that we actually had to walk out very far, like, maybe about to the, there, way about over there, near that cactus, to get any sort of tree. Which kind of sucks, but. So he's been looking for an automated tree, well, I've been looking for an automated tree farm, but there's none that are practical for 1.7.3 world. Which, you know, kind of sucks, but. Doesn't really matter. Just means that we'll grow a tree farm like that. Also, I think that one can be like it is. But I'm gonna grow it. Go ahead and grow the other one. There we go. Let me. I think I'm gonna get a little bit more birch when I'm gonna use the rest of these. Ha! It also means that uh, mobs won't spawn on this platform. That's why I did it like that. So that way I don't have to worry about every two seconds a mob coming in and jumping on me. In fact, I think I'll put a fence around this. So, ha! Now, I think that should about do it for this episode. Uh, next time, I have no idea. <laughs> next time, I have absolutely no idea what we'll do. Maybe we'll do some more caving. Actually, yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Next time, we will do more caving. Uh, see, you see you guys then.